Hello everybody, this is Glenda with Freylands and Friends Crafts Plus. And I finished project one. So tonight we're going to start project two, which is, I'm going to start a new painting. So I'm going to do one of the small squares and I'll be right back. Okay, got the first one out, and they're wrapped separately, which is great because there's four of them in a package, and, ah, there we go, so the rest of them won't get all dirty while I'm doing this one. I'm going to kind of do the background the same as I did for the first one, the big one, with that kind of mottled gray. I'm going to try and make it just a little bit lighter. Mm -hmm. I have a color theme in mind, or scheme, in mind, and I want it to work with it. Oops. I'm going to set up here with some white. I really want to use a lot more white than anything. Ugh. I don't know how that gets so nasty. Just a tad of black. I don't want a lot of black because it really, really can get dark fast. <sighs> My battery ran out on the other camera and the second battery is still charging. So, because I didn't charge it last time. So I'm going to try and do this similar to last time, but a little lighter. So, fill it with some white, tip it with some black and some brown. Fill that black with some white again. There. Okay. I think I finally got the timer on the um, what am I trying to say <laughs> the I think I finally got the um, time lapse off of it. Gee, it's kept off. Got that time lapse turned off. tan or brown, which is okay. Got a little more brown in there than I was expecting this time, but that's okay. 
we don't worry about anything like that. We just do and try our best. I will later be doing the sides the same way. <laughs> kind of like this, but not yet because <laughs> I need to be able to hold on to some. I'm just going to finish this one side. Sort of. Just getting a lot of the paint off of my brush. fix it but that'll come later okie doke so now I'm gonna let this dry and then I will be back and start I think I want to try an iris all right I probably will do some more on that right now I want to do that get the rest of those in there I'm going to do a much lighter violet on the top top petals come on there we go
Well, there's my iris. <laughs> Does it look like an iris? I hope so. I, I think it looks somewhat like an iris. <laughs> I'm going with it. Because I know me, and the more I work with stuff and just keep trying to improve it, prove it, the more I mess it up. So there's a time when I just to say to myself, Glenn, F this. I'm just letting my hair go when I wash it. Today, at least I did. I'm going to try it that way because the moosing... It, the problem is when I put my sleep mask on at night, it's like a mohawk in the morning if I use mousse. It still does that, but I can at least tame it down. <laughs> But when I've got mousse in there, it just, it's a, I have to completely wet it down again. Anyway, project one was the deer color book from the color book. And project two is the iris. And I'm going to try and do more of a gray and violet theme in that room. And I just think they go so well together. I don't want to do it all that, but... Anyway, so we've got projects one and two done. I'll write them on the board. If you do have any more suggestions, please. It can be beading. It can be uh, making sculptures. It can be making more pendants for necklaces, painting, color book, whatever you'd like. And we'll just keep going with projects until we fill that board and then we'll start over. <laughs> But I'm, I do have three more of these canvases like this that I want to do. So I love you. See you tomorrow. Mwah. Smile and wave at somebody. Good night.